Turns out public awareness does indeed make a difference. Just ask the folks at Astor Place Hair Silas in the East Village. Yeah, they were about to close down after nearly 75 years in business. Home to celebrities like Robert De Niro and Andy Warhol and Kevin Bacon, to politicians like Mike Bloomberg and Mayor de Blasio. And then word got out. Word got out and here comes the money army to the rescue. Money wise group of New Yorkers saving the day. Here's Lucy Yang. For three generations. We came out of college. We came here for a summer and we never left. And almost 73 years, Astor Place Barbershop has been grooming the wealthy, the powerful, the famous, and the everyday man. Their prices are right and their customers are happy. The customer is always right. <laughs> Especially when you're getting your hair cut. <laughs> then COVID hit. Business dried up. They couldn't pay their rent or their staff. Paul and John Veza had no choice. They were going to end the family legacy. You know, people are crying. And then some investors came to the rescue. They offered the grandsons a buyout. This popular barbershop remains down to the linoleum tiles. But these two brothers who spent their entire careers expanding what their grandfather humbly began will say goodbye Wednesday, their last day. We grew old together. <laughs> I didn't see any of my kids baseball games or soccer games on Saturdays ever. This is going to be our first Thanksgiving four day weekend off in our lives. No doubt Thanksgiving will be very emotional this year, but the owners have a lot for which to be grateful. Their shop stays open. The entire staff keeps their jobs and the brothers will finally have a chance to relax.